we're being asked to expand, so let's go ahead and do it. Solution. We have a fraction, so we'll use the quotient rule. So this is the natural log of 9 e cubed minus the natural log of x. Here we're, we're multiplying, so we'll use the product rule. So this is the natural log of 9 plus the natural log of e cubed minus the natural log of x. There's nothing we can do with the natural log of 9, so it's just the natural log of 9. Here we can take the 3 and put it in the front. So this is plus 3 natural log of e minus natural log of x. Now, there's other ways to do this. We could have just done this. Right, that always works because you have the natural log of e to the x. That's equal to x always, so we could have just done that. Um, I have no idea why I did it this way. Uh, so this is the natural log of 9 plus 3 times, and then the natural log of e is 1, and then minus the natural log of x. So the final answer is the natural log of 9 plus 3 minus the natural log of x. I hope this helps someone out there.